Today, we'll be learning how to install and play Honkai Star Rail on the Steam Deck within SteamOS Gaming Mode, fast and easy with full controller support. From Desktop Mode, access the Discover Store and in the bottom left, we want to click Settings. And on this screen, we want to click Add Source. In the description of this video, we want to copy the repository command and instead of pasting directly into our source field that has appeared, we want to open the Steam keyboard with Steam and X and press the paste button. This is to avoid any issues with the source field closing by itself when right click and pasting, so make sure you use the Steam keyboard and press paste. Close the keyboard and press add. If you perform those steps correctly, you will be asked for your Steam Deck password, which you can set from the taskbar below by clicking System Settings, User Management, and configuring your password from there. Use the Steam keyboard to enter your password and press OK. A third source in your Discover Store settings will now be available, where we want to search in the Discover Store for Honkers. Type this and we want to go ahead and install the Honkers Railway Launcher. Once installed, click Launch, choose Continue, read the warning notice to make sure you understand, and press Continue. Select Agree if you agree, and for our default paths, if you are installing the game to your internal drive, simply go ahead and press Continue. However, if you wish to install the game to a micro SD card, select the I know what I'm doing toggle and navigate to a folder on your micro SD, select this and press open. Once you've chosen where you want the game to be installed, press continue. Keep your Wine and DXVK versions as they are and press download. Next, we will be prompted with a Wine installer, which we can go ahead and press install. Once those initial configurations have been set up, we will be prompted to restart the program. So go ahead and press restart. When Honkers Railway Launcher loads again, we need to press download and wait for the game in its entirety to download, which is around 33 gigabytes. Once your game is downloaded, go ahead and take a look through the settings, familiarizing yourself with what each selection does. But for the most part, these can be left as they are, and we can switch between modern and classic view for our launcher. I'm going to switch to classic, so that when we load the Honkers launcher, it will look like the traditional launcher for the game itself. Don't press launch yet, we want to close the launcher and instead access Steam. And from the bottom left, we want to choose add a non-Steam game. From the list, you will see the Honkers Railway Launcher. Select this and add a selected program. Find this now in your library and choose Add to Favorites and access the settings. All we need to do in here is highlight Honkers Railway Launcher and with the Steam keyboard, with Steam and X, erase our highlighted text and instead type Honkai Star Rail. Close the window and simply return to gaming mode. Back in gaming mode, we can add cover art if you have installed Decky Loader and the Steam Grid DB plugin. If you wish to do this now, I have a link in the description so you can go ahead and learn how to do this from desktop mode. So once that's done, or you want to do it later, let's access our favorites and launch Honkai Star Rail for the first time. When the launcher appears, Go ahead and press Launch Game. And when you reach the login screen, go ahead and press the Steam and X button for the Steam keyboard and enter your username and password. Or if you have a Google, Facebook, Twitter or Apple account, you can select these and log in by those. When you log in, you'll be asked to solve the puzzle, check your email for a code and enter this as well. Once those are done, go ahead and agree to all the terms if required, and start the game. Once you're in the game, let's access our graphics settings. 
I opted for medium with 60 FPS and a rendering quality of 1.0, although you can adjust this to your own preferences and enjoy the game the way you want to. I hope this guide helped you all with getting Honkai Star Rail installed on the Steam Deck within SteamOS Gaming Mode. If you enjoyed the video, I'd be grateful if you would give me a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel and share this guide with others. The reason the game is playable through this method is due to the Honkers launcher using some tricks to allow the game to be played on Linux. However, I must advise that this method has been in use for quite some time, but carries the risk of being patched if Hoyoverse understand what is going on. So if you have come this far and got the game working on your Steam Deck or Linux, please, by all means, share the method but try to keep it to yourself and let others know this too. This way we can all guarantee that we continue to enjoy the game on the Steam Deck for the foreseeable future. If any of this changes in the future, I will update the pinned comment and description with the game's current status on Steam Deck after patches, and I encourage you all to look out for one another and comment if something changes. So let's hope the game stays this way and continue to enjoy. Until next time, if you have any questions, please let me know. Enjoy the game, have a wonderful day, and I'll see you later.